Hi, my name is Amy Mozzie, and I'm with Supreme Boats. And today I have the privilege of walking you through the all new 2022 Supreme S240. And just like the brand name suggests, this boat is Supreme. And I can't wait to show you this 24 foot, 16 person capacity wake surf boat. Let's check it out. When we talk about Supreme's 2022 model year, we're talking about a completely new brand. And I'm not just talking about the two new models we're offering for 2022 or the new brand redesign of the logo and the graphical representations of this brand. I'm talking about the brand new factory we've opened in Valdosta, Georgia, that's building these beautiful boats. This year is going to be monumental for the Supreme brand. So get on board. Let's go. The first time you see the new 2022 Supreme S240, it's going to be hard to place, especially if you see it from the bow. It's not quite a ZS wide bow, but then again, it's nowhere near that traditional V bow. It's got a style all its own. It has all the accommodation of a wide bow, yet it's got that refined, elegant, aggressive style all rolled into this one front end. The S240 is beautiful, even at the beginning of your relationship. The refined yet aggressive look of the S240 continues through to the back of the boat. So even on the side of the hull, you can tell this isn't that overly edgy style. This is something that is refined yet aggressive at the same time. This gel coat scheme behind me is called the sharp scheme. This allows you to accentuate those lines. But if you choose to go even a little more traditional, you've got the option of the core scheme, which has more color on the side of the boat, but it doesn't accentuate these sharp lines quite as much. You've got the choice with the S240. You can go aggressive, you can go traditional, somewhere in between, it's your choice. The customization available on the 2022 Supreme, specifically the S240, is pretty unbelievable, especially for a value class boat. And as we always say, these Supremes transcend that value class segment. This is one of the reasons why. This year you can not only choose between 31 different gel coat colors, two different schemes. You also now have the choice of three different color Supreme Chromex decals. Chromex is a hard part, so this is not uh, a squishy decal. It's not something, a sticker you can peel on and off. This is actually part of the boat. You can now get it in white, just like you see here, black and silver. The white and black are a matte finish, and even when they're tone on tone like this here, you can see that difference in the decal. It makes it look custom and extremely high end, as high end as the boat is itself. The 2022 Supreme S240 is not only a brand new model, it has a completely new running surface. We call it the Easy V hull. The reason we do is it takes you from easy to the zone behind the boat. You can get this boat off the trailer with as much as 4,800 pounds of ballast and displace that water right away, making a wave on either side of the boat as well as a symmetrical wakeboard wake. It's that easy. And once you're ready to load it back on the trailer or maybe you're doing some slow speed handling in uh, the dock or marina area, this boat responds completely and exactly the way you need it to. When you're loading it on the trailer, because of the deep V design, there's no place for this to go except perfectly straight between the bunks, exactly where it needs to be. It is literally easy, the easy V. So once the easy V hull underneath the Supreme S240 displaces all that water, how we make a surf wave is with quick surf. And the way quick surf works is there's a plate mounted on either corner of the transom of the boat. What that plate does is it goes down opposite the surf side. That creates lift opposite the surf side and consequently digs the surf corner. It displaces the surf corner. That's what makes the wave. So it takes all of that water that's being displaced, makes it into a curl, and then you can switch it back and forth from regular to goofy, goofy to regular in 1.8 seconds. It's that fast and it's that good. And because this boat uses displacement to create the surf wave, it's got push. And when you weight this boat evenly, all of the ballast full 
as much as 4,800 pounds, you've got an extremely long, pushy wave that can be your endless wave for days on end. So the running surface of the S240 is specifically made to do well in rough water with its deep V, create a great surf wave and wakeboard wake. But what we've got on the back here in the center of the transom of the boat is the stinger wake plate. What this does is it adjusts the running attitude of the boat. So when it's down, it will get the V of the bow, the front of the boat down into the water, cutting through the chop with the most aggressive part of the V. When it's up, it allows the nose of the boat to come up and to displace more water at the transom. What you can do with this is adjust the shape of your wave and your wakeboard wake because you're changing the wetted surface of the boat by going through these different settings with this plate. And it has a, a hundred points of adjustability. So there's a lot of variability there that you have control over. But this is a little different. This is the silent stinger. So not only does it have the functionality of the stinger wake plate, it also has sound dampening benefits. What that means is it takes down the noise of the engine and it makes it quieter on the inside of the boat. It does that by taking the exhaust from the engine and running it into this plate that also has water being forced into the bottom of it. Those two tumble together in a series of baffles that dampens the noise of the engine. It makes it so much quieter. You can have a normal conversation on the interior of the boat and you still have the adjustability of the wake plate. As you step up into the Supreme S240, you realize you're, you're pretty high. I mean, this boat is deep. It's got a lot of freeboard, as we call it. So it's got a lot of deep seating in it, which means that when you're making those waves and wakes behind this boat, you don't have to worry about taking water over the back or water over the bow. You're sitting in the boat and sheltered from all of that. But the best part about stepping up on the back is this back area here. It's super accommodating. We've got seats, you can hang out on the sun pad, lay out if you want. Uh, the swim step's also pretty easy to get up on. And I should know because I need a lot of help typically. If the ballast isn't full in this boat, I have to uh, haul myself up onto the swim step. And this one allows you uh, an easier time of that because it's got some rocker, some roll off towards the trailing edge. And it gives me a better opportunity to get up and not look um, quite as old as I am doing it. <laughs> but you've also got an optional ladder that you can get on this swim step, which makes everybody look like a pro when they're getting up on the back of the 240. So we've also got storage in the back here. So I can throw my shoes back here. They never have to make it onto the inside of the boat. Or I can throw drinks in there. There's a drain. I can store ropes, gloves, whatever I happen to have that I really don't want on the inside of the boat with me can stay right out here. And the S240 can do all of that and much more. Let's check out the rest. As you step into the Supreme S240, you start to realize this is a 24 foot boat. I mean, not only do you sit down in this boat, but it's kind of like a stretch limo on the inside. This lounge is huge, which gives a great variability to the seating and it gives you lots of storage. So I've got storage underneath every seat in here and it's all hinge storage. So what that helps me with is if I've got my hands full, I can lift this cushion with one hand, stow my gear with the other. It's really easy to use and it accommodates 16 people and all their stuff and it can be put away. One thing you'll notice about 2022 Supremes is specifically the vinyl. Not just the scheme of the vinyl, but the color choices and the type of vinyl we're putting in the boats this year. So this year we're using Spradling vinyl that has a 17 mil top coat. And you have two different choices for the interior schemes. You have what we call an all OTB scheme or an all outside the box texture on all of your vinyl, or you can just do that outside the box texture on the accents. So what you see here, this is the all OTB scheme. So it's all textured and you guessed it, it's red. It's a lot of red, it looks good. But the great thing about this vinyl, because of the texture, even though it's a darker color, it's gonna be 10 to 15 degrees cooler than that same color in a flat vinyl. The reason being this surface area 
dissipates heat better because there's more of it. And that's great, especially when you're in uh, California, Arizona, Texas, where it gets really hot. You can still enjoy these darker colors and not burn yourself in the process. But the other piece of this vinyl that's extremely, extremely valuable is just how easy it is to clean. And it resists abrasions as well. That 17 mil top coat will keep things from staining it, sticking to it, things that you can just wipe off that would normally stain another vinyl. You can also guard against cutting it with fins or things that are sharp. This is really resilient stuff. And it's all held together with Gore-Tonera thread. Gore-Tonera thread is made by, you guessed it, Gore-Tex. And it is strong stuff. In fact, it, where it brings the upholstery together is probably stronger than the upholstery itself. Part of that is because we stitch it not just one time, but at least two times, and as many as three times in really high stress areas. So it gives this vinyl great bounce back it's pulled tight but it's never going to come apart you're never going to see an area of this interior where there's one single stitch holding two pieces of vinyl together you're always going to have a half stitch or even a french seam which is three stitches it takes extra time it takes extra material costs us a little bit more but it's the right way to build an interior and yes we do that in the supreme line so I know we've talked a lot about customization in the Supreme Boats and the S240 is no different. You have a lot of ways to customize this boat to be exactly how you want it to be and look on the water. This particular boat has the gator step flooring scheme. We call this the Supreme Cut. And what this allows you to do is get non-skid in your boat that is colored just the way you want it. There's actually two different layers that you can color and choose between 15 different color choices on each. So I can take this bottom layer, which in this boat is colored black, and I can choose between 14 other colors if I want to. I can choose the top layer as well, just as many choices there. I can make this boat look in almost every aspect of it exactly the way I want to in this S240 Supreme. Like we talked about, the Supreme S240 is a big boat. It's 24 feet long. It accommodates as many as 16 people, and you can really feel that on the interior. But what we've done is we've given you the versatility to accommodate those people however they want to sit. For instance, this year you can opt for the slide seat. This is a three position slide seat, which means the first position is back. Uh, all the way back in the lounge so it makes this a wraparound lounge then you can push it up to this position that I'm in now especially if you want to change the weight distribution for say your wakeboard wake or you just want to sit differently in the boat you can also opt to get a color matched gel coat color match table to plug into this slide seat you can also get rear facing lean backs or you can use them to face forward you've got a lot of adjustability just with this one slide seat, you can do a lot of different configurations. It's got one more setting where you can be way close to the driver and the passenger and kind of all huddle up in the front with almost a front lounge. Uh, this boat can really be anything you want it to be. This year's standard on Supreme Boats is going to be the Stainless Shine Tower. We call it the SST. What it is, is a sparkling example of what a standard tower can be. This thing is beautiful. It is stable. I mean, it's rock solid. It's made by CMI out of South Carolina. And what they do is they also make towers for military boats, for first responder boats. These things are stout. They are built to last, but they're beautiful as well, all made out of stainless, except for the base, which is cast. It's a cast aluminum base. Everything else is out of stainless, and you can even get that base color matched. You can get it in either white or black, and you can get all these options on the SST tower. So we've got Bombshell 2.0 racks. We've got the Hero sound system from Wet Sounds. We've also got the available So Long Bimini, which has as the name would suggest, so long. It covers almost the entire lounge in this 24 foot boat. This SST tower is not only beautiful, but it accommodates every customizable option you can think of, and you've gotta check it out. So for 2022, we are not only offering the wet sound stereo system, the stereo system is standard. You can upgrade to the Champ package, which is two 
of these Rev 10 horns on the tower. Or you can go to the Hero package, which like this here is the Hero 4 speaker package. But new for this year, we are offering these speakers in white as well as black. So you can have another ability to customize the look of your boat. You've already customized the sound. If you have one of these wet sound stereo packages, people are going to hear it all across the lake and think, man, that's a custom stereo system in that Supreme. So I know there's 15 other seats in the Supreme S240 and they're all let's face it, pretty nice to sit in, but there is no place that's as good as the driver's seat. And that's where we are now. I mean, not only do we have a swivel seat, we can adjust it forward and back. We've got this awesome steering wheel, um, the Sure Grip steering wheel. This thing allows us to feel like we have control over the boat. It's not some skimpy little steering wheel and it goes with the design. Not to mention, I have easy control over my Stinger wake plate, or in this boat's case, it's got a silent Stinger wake plate on it. And I don't have to take my eyes off the water to move it up or down. And remember, that can either change the shape of the wave, change the shape of the wake, or if I'm trying to get the most aggressive part of the V down into the water, so I'm cutting through the chop on a rough day, I can do that here too. But the great thing about this dash is it's easily navigable. What I mean by that, I've got my 7-inch Omni screen, my touch screen in the center, I've got my rocker switches on my right. In this one, I have an optional heater, and this year, new for Supreme, they're putting the heater in the dash so the driver doesn't get neglected when it comes to being cold. And then, probably my favorite, is the wireless charging clamping cell phone holder. Yes, I said it. It is my favorite thing. Why? Because it's a great location. I can always see my phone from here. And if I've got my phone Bluetooth to the screen, I can control the stereo from my phone or from the screen, whatever's most convenient. But it's also charging and it charges my phone even through the OtterBox. So I love this phone holder. I'm, I'm going to admit it. I'm going to stick with that. So the location of everything in the Supreme S240 dash area is perfect. I've, I've got a low brow height on the dash. I can always see the water in front of me. And because this boat has almost no bow rise, and if it does, I can adjust it with my wake plate, I can always see out in front of the boat. So I'm comfortable driving. If I need to raise my level or my perspective, I can use the flip up bolster as well. But right now, I'm focused on my screen and it's front and center, it's seven inches wide, it's easy for me to see, and very easy to navigate. So all I need to do is choose one of the menu items that's on my menu to the left. I can toggle between my speed control, my surf system, quick surf, my ballast levels, my mapping, and my stereo control, all just with a touch of the screen. It gives me easy access to almost every system in the boat, and that's what I love about this Supreme. The S240 specifically is a big enough boat for me and my family, yet it's easy enough to use. I can get them back there surfing quickly, fill up everything, turn my quick surf on. Everybody's happy all day long. So I realize I've neglected to tell you about maybe typically my favorite place to sit in the boat. I mean, I said it was the driver's area. It is. And traditionally in most boats, that's going to be the best place to sit. You're in control. You've got a comfortable place to sit. But really where we all want to be is in the bow. It's just in a lot of cases in the bow, in a water sports boat, it's pretty bumpy. It's not as comfortable. Well, not this Supreme S240. This S240 has a modified deep V underneath it. What does that mean? It means a smooth, even in rough water ride. That's why it makes the bow a great place to sit. And that's where I'm going to now. It's only appropriate that we end this walkthrough where it began at the bow. And this is the first part of the boat you see, the first part of the boat that stands out to you. But once you sit in it, you realize just how comfortable this boat is. And when it's on the water, when you're running through rough, rough water or smooth, this boat accommodates you in the bow. You can have a couple people up here. I can have this done up as a playpen essentially, or I can remove this filler cushion, make it a little lounge. It's got speakers, cup holders, I have power points, I can charge my phone if I want to. I even have access to the storage in the OB from in the bow. So I've got everything up here 
even some handles to hold on uh, when somebody's trying to take a tight turn. But this boat, the Supreme S240, is accommodating all the way through, 24 feet long, room for 16 people, and let's face it, it's awesome. You've got to check out this Supreme at your local dealer today. So I hope you've enjoyed the walkthrough on the 2022 Supreme S240. This boat is everything it appears to be and more, but don't take my word for it. Visit your local Supreme Boats dealer and let us prove it to you today.